Chapters are a feature that YouTube gives us to divide a video into smaller sections. And today I will show you how to add chapters to your YouTube videos. So there are some rules you need to follow for adding chapters to your videos, otherwise it will not work. So each chapter has a starting timestamp, but more importantly, the very first timestamp of your video must start at zero seconds and near it you can write what the chapter is about. If you forget to include the initial timestamp, then your chapter is not gonna work. The second rule is there must be at least three timestamps that you should include to your video if you want to make your chapters work. They should be in a chronological order and the format of your timestamps should have columns between minutes and seconds. If you use something like that or like that, then it is not going to work. Adding chapters to your YouTube videos has some benefits both for the viewer and for the creator. For the viewer, for example, it will be easier to navigate and find the parts of a video where they would like to more interested in watching. And it shows that your videos have some kind of a structure, they are more organized. Adding chapters also has some benefits for you, for the creator, which is for example, it helps your video for a better SEO, for a better search engine optimization. Because when you are adding chapters, you are giving basically more information, more context, what your video is about, then you will have a more likely chance to rank your video higher. And secondly, you can also find out which parts are more interesting for your audience if you look at your analytics. And later you can create a separate video, maybe only for that section. Let me show you in an example how to add chapters to your YouTube videos. Firstly, you need to go to your YouTube Studio app and then choose one of your videos. Let's say this one. Click on details. So if I start the video, Currently, we see that there aren't any chapters. From your description, if you wish, you can add a title. This is optional. Let's say timestamps. And here below, you need to write with this format, firstly, the initial timing and near it. If you want, you can put a dash or you can put parentheses and put the timestamp inside the parentheses. Let's say put a dash and near it, you write what the chapter is about let's say intro, okay? Then you switch to the second one. The second timestamp should be where your second chapter starts. Let's say that it starts at 42 seconds. And then here you will write what your chapter is about, okay? And you keep doing it till you reach to the last chapter. And you need to include at least three chapters. So click on save. And when I reload it, now we can see that our chapters are here. All right, so now let me reply to frequently asked questions about chapters. And the first one is, can you add chapters to a video that has already been published? The answer is yes, you can do that. As I showed before, uh, you can add or remove chapters from your YouTube studio for already published videos or the new videos that you are going to upload. And the next question is, should you add chapters to all of your videos? I think it depends, it is up to you. If you think your video is too long, then you can add, you can include chapters to uh, divide it into smaller sections. Or let's say that your video explains something step by step, or if your video answers like 10 different questions, then maybe it makes sense to include chapters to your videos. So should you add chapters or not? It is actually an optional thing. It is up to you. If you think it makes sense to include it, then go for it. Otherwise, you can leave it as it is. So I hope you find this video helpful. If you need more tips about YouTube, then check out this playlist.